Think you got what it takes? Yeah, we killed the buffalo! Oh my god, big moment, Lord ladies and gentlemen. The Well, uh, howdy, buckaroos, buckarats, mustache, Van Dam here, hanging out today, doing stuff. Thanks, playing some more Outlaws of the Old West. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. You know what? This game kind of came out of left field, man. It definitely came out of left field, and I've been having a really fun time playing it. Like the graphics aren't, you know, like the bestest of of all time, uh, but they, it's it's pretty deep. There's a lot going on, and so I was talking to Mousy Mars over at LogicServers.com. He went ahead and got some servers ready to go for it. So we have a private server now. It's unbelievable and amazing. So we can go ahead and do stuff and things as a community and do all the things. I was streaming the game last night. If you want to check it out, make sure you head over to twitch.tv slash Slipgator. There's a link in the down there. You can see more stuff and things. Uh, I think maybe we'll go like this. So anyway, this is the new server. I decided to just log right in, get stuff and things going here. Let's go like this, like this. Uh, we'll do double windows on this side, here, crap, here, here, here. Uh, but yeah, so what I'm going to do today, since we just released a video of this game, you saw me doing a lot of the building stuff, you saw all of this stuff, I thought we'd come back, I'm going to try to power through some of this part of the game, I want to build a little bit of a bigger house, uh, we did log on to one of the official servers last night on the stream, and we did some stuff and things there. Um, but we're going to have to start over. Um, and yeah, so, so far, so good. Really fun. Really cool stuff. Check it out, man. We've already got the beginnings of a house going over here. Um, and the deepness, man. I got into building a huge amount of stuff last night, guys. I mean, we were down into the anvil. We had the table saw going. We had the mega campfire up and running. Uh, we were, we had guns, like all of the things, um, so yeah, I'm very excited to see kind of where this goes. Make sure if you decide you want to get a private server of your own, go to logicservers.com, use the code SLIP. I think it's SLIP, SL1P. You should be able to get 20% or a certain percentage off your first month if you choose to do that. Um, and so far, the server's been running really, really good. Um, let's pop inside of here real quick. Let's talk about crafting some stuff and things. What do I need? Rope? Let's just go ahead and make as much of it as we can. I think if I shift click... Shift click, craft all, there's 20. All right, so 20 ropes going over there. That's pretty G's. Uh, let's pop in over here. I'm gonna continue, like I said, to do some building stuff. And uh, when we get some stuff ready to go so I can show you guys, I'll be our bees, Pete. Dude, there's buffalo. You guys think we should cheese some buffalo? You can't get me, homie. I'm on top of my deal. Yeah, that's right. Ready to brain. Back. I got 20 arrows. Oh, he's running away. Dude, he went in the water. What? Oh, crap. I got to go get him. Come on, man. Oh, he's coming back, yo. I think he might be. Okay, we might be in trouble here. Get in the house! Well, I can't hit him. No! I only have one. Oh, no. Four arrows left. Come on, man. We got this. Come here, buffalo. It's all over for you, you stupid dink. You think you got what it takes? Yeah! We killed the buffalo! Oh, my God. Big moment, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to get 16 raw meat and 8 raw hide. <clears throat> Pardon me. The raw hide. I'm so overcome with joy. The rawhide is so hard to get, and uh, it's what you need in order to build the beginning clothes. And it's really way more difficult than it should be. So that was pretty amazing. Uh, yeah, we got a second story going on over here, man. We got some pillars coming up over into this area right here. I think from here, I'm just going to go ahead and put a top on this for now. Uh, why don't we do like a... Can we do like a two-stage deal, maybe? What is this? Triangle left? I think that means I'm going to put it on the right because I'm backwards. Maybe not. And we're back. I made a church, kind of. I don't even know what this is. It's a weird building. I'm having a little bit of trouble with placing one ceiling in the center there. But I figured we might leave that for an air vent. Do, old, do these old houses need air vents? I feel like they don't. But check it out, guys. We're going to make it unbelievable and amazing. Are you ready for this? Wait, no. Are you ready for this? 
Oh, yeah. Just like so. Uh, let's go like this. Oh, uh, oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm liking it. That's wrong. No one loves you. Why isn't this not placing the right way? What is happening to my world? Suddenly, it's not working. Leave that guy. Maybe that was why. Bang. There we go. That was real, real weird. All right. Like this. Like these guys. Oh, feels good. Feels good to be building a house, man. Out in the old west. Ye olde west. This guy like so. Like this. Nope. He's done it again. Jeez Louise. All right. One of these. One of these. One of those. Pretty easy to build in this game. They did the arc thing with the pillars. And you know what I mean? Like you have to build so close to a supporting structure or something like that. So it's a little bit weird when you have to do those sorts of things. Um, it's fine. It's perfectly fine, but it is definitely weird. And I built up top where I had trouble with the little air vent deal. Dude, I built, I mean, ceilings and pillars and all the things everywhere. And I just could not get it to work. So let's pop inside of here now. See, we have some extra pillars. This actually, we don't need that guy. These two, we do need to support the entire roof. But if I try to build up inside of here like this, uh, well, I had a, I had a whole st support structure up here. Wait, what? What happened to this? What are you talking about, man? Uh, no, that guy. No, this guy. Uh, this guy. Okay. He's done it. Uh, so yeah, I had a whole deal over here, but we're going to build something a little bit different up here. Pop in here like this. Let's go like this. I think we'll do like that. Like this. I want these to be, I want these to face a certain way. So I want to make sure I'm going to come down here. There we go. Go like that, like that, and then like that. And then why don't we up here go ahead and can we replace? Is that a thing? Oh, dude, what's going to happen when I break this? Okay. All right. Oh, geez. All right. So let's go like this, like that, like so. See what I'm saying, man? Looks good, team. Uh, do we want to do a window up here, even though there's a door? Oh, wait. Neither of these match now? Okay. I think that was a visual good. What? What the crap? <laughs> All right. Maybe there is a chink in the armor. Oh, wait. I know why. Because this is on a half wall. All right. So you see this right here? There's a half wall right there. It's, you really can't see it. So this being on the half wall has caused us to have a major problemo. All right, we might have to redesign. I kind of love it, though. I love the little walkway out here. Let's go ahead and just take a look. If we pop down over here, is that what I can pick back up? Yeah, that looks cool. I mean, obviously, we need to finish the top there. And then, is it on the half wall, though? Wait, what? Full wall, full wall. I don't think it is on the half wall. All right, so anywho, so let's check out some stuff and things. Oh, I did build this guy right here. Uh, inventory clogged full of stuff. Can't find. There we go. Uh, and then this guy is the biggest or the fastest cooker that we can make. We do have to place it on the ground. Uh, maybe right here. And then I'm going to interact with this bad ombre. I'm going to shift, click, and then I'm going to split this stack. Or I'm going to get like maybe 17 coal. Squirt that in there. We're going to put all 37 meat that I've got. Ignite that bad ombre. And then we're going to be doing that stuff. Uh, let's go back into our crafting deal and talk about <clears throat> the tannery, uh, the fishing trap, the snare, the loom, the log trough, the horse post, the beak. Oh, we need planks. And then we need this guy. So we need leather. All right. So that's why we're going to have to get this guy up and running first. So the tannery. Again, I don't believe we can place this inside, which is real, real weird. Um, so we're going to place it over this way. Let's go like this. Can we do it like right? There was a spot. It was really great. Maybe not. All right, right here. Oh, there we go. I'd love it to be a little bit closer over here. Yeah, we'll go with it like that. All right, so inside of here now, we can go ahead and craft up one leather. We can make a bota, drinking water container. We can craft a whip, but really I want pants. Let's get some hot pants action going over here. Back into our inventory crafting. Let's go ahead and talk about the table saw. We have the loom being crafted up right now. And then... All right, we got the snare. Okay, so the snare... Let's try to set a snare. I set a snare last night in the stream, but I didn't catch anything. 
I'm going to set that snare down right over there. And then the fishing trap. Dude, we set one of these guys up last night, and it was a bonanza, a gold mine. We're going to set one guy right there. I'm actually going to make a second fishing trap. Go ahead and start crafting that guy up. Okay, on the side of our deal here, let's talk about this bad ombre. You can water your horses with this, or you can use, um, you can just use a lake. So set that guy up right over there like so. What's coming next? Wait, did we already get this? The hitching post? Let's put a hitching post up so we can hitch our horses once we tame them. And yes, by the way, you can tame in this game. Um, and that's one of the things that we're going to be working on. Actually, inside of... Dude, where is it, the lasso? Crafting? I think it's in the loom. Inventory. There's the loom. Now, these guys we can place inside. Let's pop back over here like so. Let's place our loom right nice and snugly in the corner. And then also we have our sawmill deal. And I'm going to put the little gears facing out here. Uh, like so. All right. Loom. There it is. Hot lasso action. Inside of here. Planks for days. We're going to need a whole batch load. How much wood do I got? And we're out. All right. So, you guys, we did all the stuff and things. And then I think we have yet another fish trap we're going to put down over here. Right next to our other guy. Kind of like so, maybe? Face it this way. Check this out. Oh, there's none in there yet. Crap! Do we have to put stuff and things in there? To get fish? I wonder. Oh. Spoiled meat? No. I think last time it just worked. We didn't have to do anything to it. So maybe it's going to take some time for us. All right. Back over inside of here. There's our lasso, baby. So that's going to allow us to tame stuff. And now we also have eight planks. And planks are what we needed. What were the auto running? Planks are what we needed in order to do what? I think we needed them for the beekeep. Uh, we're going to need some wood for the well. Carpentry bench. I bet everything else we're going to actually have to go back and get some wood. Uh, so pretty cool stuff, man. There's the beehive going on doing its thing. Um, pop back over here real quick. Pants! Are you guys ready for this? Uh, pants? Dude, look how freaking ripped I am! Dude, Mustache Van Dam is so ripped. He's so cut. He's gonna get such a bad sunburn. Dude, can we craft sunblock? We're gonna need some. All my levels into accuracy. Let's go team! We snared a rabbit! Dude, it worked! The snare worked. Do we have to do anything to it? I don't think so. And there was just a rabbit on the ground over here. Dude, the snare is epic, man. Mustache Van Dam comes up upon a crash head wagon full of bad hombres. You know, I know these guys are bad hombres right now. I'm not even going to say. I'm not even going to. I'm not even going to mince words. Can you imagine some, like, having a little problem <laughs> with, with your freaking deal? And then this guy comes out of the woods? Dude, I would be freaking out, man. All right, you guys ready? Three, go. Nailed it, Ace the Campy Stop. Three bandits down, and I can't see a GD thing. Uh, why is that in my... It goes in your bow slot. The SSA. All right, we got a weapon, face bandana, and money. We got other stuff. Things. Hold on here. Let's get these other guys. Pistol ammo added. What do we got going on over here now? Dude, a bandana? Equip. What do we look like? Oh, dude. Look at our mustache sticking out of a bandana. Perfect. <clears throat> uh, looks like we got two of these guys. The peacemaker. Dude, equip. Show me my peacemaker. Uh, there we go. Dude, look at my little peacemaker pistol. Dude, I'm ready to take on the world now. Little ADS action. Wow, is that really, really weird? Is it? Okay, my sensitivity is like whacked right now. Uh, six shots. Hold on. Maybe it's because I got this in my hand. Is it better? Okay, maybe. Let's just put this down. Let me see here. Okay, let's go like so. Let's stick this guy in our slot. Did you hear that? I heard something. Now, I don't believe these guys actually, like, these wagons have any loot. But I did see Buffalo. 
Oh, this one right over here, man. Where you at, Buffalo? Buffalo butt? Oh, almost got him. Maybe we'll just take on this bad hombre right here. Dude, more than six shots? You kidding me? Oh, dude, there's another one coming. You want to take it to the limit, homie? How many bullets do I have? I mean, almost done, right? 11? I need a shirt! Nailed it! Ace and can't be stopped. The crack shot mustache Van Dam is triumphant again. So we are beyond... <gasps> this is exactly what we're looking for. We're beyond far from our home. Oh, wait! Zoink! I hit it. Oh crap, a miss. No. A hit. We're taming. A hit. Yes, we did it. We got a horse. He's tamed. You guys, I'm sorry you really couldn't see it. <laughs> and it's so quick. We were just an opportunistic hunter. So you got to pull out your lasso and then you throw it like so. So uh, you can, I think, right click and then kind of go like that you got to hit him pretty close to like dead on then it gives you the little mini game which we did and we actually the first time i did it i nailed it and i aced it and i couldn't be stopped uh this time it didn't look like we got all of them but we definitely got enough and we've tamed up our horse open mount inventory name our mount dude the perfect name for any horse kevin all right kevin let's ride dude we're so far from home we have so far to go yeah Hold on. Yeah! Dude, I just did a 180 on a horse. Is that even legal in this state? All right, coming back into the home base. Uh, we definitely still have some repairs to do over here, but I figured we would just to, like kind of show you some of the stuff and things that I built. Let me go like so. If you pull out your lasso and then you bring a lassoed horse to attach. I think we lasso him like this. That didn't even work a little bit. Dude, he's right here. Okay, and then we hit E. Now, it is, he is tied up, even though you can't see it. It's a little bit of a weirdness. Do we get any more stuff and things over here? No, it doesn't look like it. I did build the beehive deal, and so we have honey and beeswax being created inside of there that we'll need in the future. Uh, also, a bunch of machines got made. Oh, and we have grass spawn in the base. Uh, but yeah, down inside of here now, let's talk about it. This guy, the oldie carpentry bench. Let's place this guy down right back over here. Feels good to me. Um, I want to stick the anvil. Maybe like this. Oh, you know what? You know what? I got the perfect deal. Hold on. Let's anvil right here. Then let's talk about this guy right there. The stone forge. So this is kind of a neat thing they've added in. Check this out. So we put the forge over here like so, right? Now, you can see if we climb up top here... The top of the forge kind of doesn't necessarily stick through the top of the ceiling that well. It kind of is weird. That actually isn't bad, but we can make it bigger. And it's a really nice little aesthetic piece to this game. Check it out. Come over here like so. Increase the height. And now if we pop outside, be sticking right out. Look, it's a chimney, man. It looks beauteous. Glorious and beauteous. Um, I also built this guy right here. Uh, it's just a huge deal. And we could put this maybe back over... Well, how about right there? We could just stick this guy right here. And then we can increase the height of it. And it should be sticking out the top now. It looks like it's a little off to one side, but I ain't too worried about it. Good enough for government work. Blocks our window. Maybe we'll move it. <laughs> All right. So a bunch more machines now. These guys are what we're looking at first, man. The next tier axe and pickaxe. So we can craft up uh, or gather materials more betterly. Um, also, check out all this other stuff. Dude, we have a lot of wood now. Wait, wrong guy. Let's go ahead and interact with this. I don't want to craft all. Let's make a few more planks. Let's pop inside of here. Uh, mailbox, large mailbox. Uh, a bed we're going to need canvas for. Uh, standing torches? I wonder if they last indefinitely. Oh, and we need a bucket, too. Let's make the bucket, the standing torch, plank trough, the town bell, whiskey keg. 
There's tons of like aesthetic things that we can make. It's so cool. All right, these guys we're pulling out of here. We will use those after these weapons break or these tools break. Uh, crafted items, a bucket. And then we're in the wrong machine again. There we go. Seven planks. So the bucket, I think, let me see how this works. I haven't used the bucket yet. Did we put it on there? Did we go like this? Okay, we have a bucket. Is it, did that just happen? Is the bucket full of water? Is there a way to know? Oh, is that the, the deal on the side there? I want to see if we can fill up the trough over here. All right. I think I got it. You can actually see there's water in my bucket now. I figured it out. So over here, uh, E, make Kevin eat and <laughs> take all food items. Dude, what? We want to fill it with water. What are you talking about, man? Oh, it's not a watering trough. It's a food trough. But it says right here, press E with bucket equipped to add water. All right. So is it a food trough or a water trough? I'm not really sure. And it looks like that's all the water we can add to it. Dude, that is kind of weird. Can we get shake water out of our deal? All right. If I unequip this, does it maintain its water in my inventory? Interesting. And... All right, put this guy away. Oh, it stays in my uh, my torch slot. All right, feels good, team. Uh, no new skill points, but did we get enough rawhide to make any more clothes? Dude, shirt. Oh, my God, we're going to make a shirt. And then we can make a fringed vest or a fringed coat. Dude, can we wear a shirt and a vest? Let's make the vest. And it looks like we haven't got enough stuff and things to make anything else. All right, hold on here. Oh, we look like a guy. We definitely got to look like we're some sort of a guy. Uh, let's go like this, like that. Equip that guy. Oh, we're looking, we're looking so clean. Dude, that looks like a really high-end suede. And then we made the vest now. Can we wear oh, you can. You can wear the vest over the shirt. Dude, that's really cool. Does it add anything in here that I can see? Do these have like an armor level? Weight, durability. Oh, they give us health and temperature. Ah, because it does get quite hot. I mean, it's 80 degrees here. It was 106 degrees earlier uh, when I was out on the horse, when we were out on Kevin doing stuff and things. Let's go ahead and grab the rest of these planks. You actually can't combine stacks like that. You have to put it in your inventory, then combine. But over inside of here, I thought there was like a lower level mailbox we could make. I don't need the large mailbox. A signpost, a gun cabinet, town sign, bunk beds, the well. This bed we need canvas for? I think it said four. Can we make the canvas over in this guy? Uh, hide, hide sleeping bag? Oh, uh, we probably should. It looks like we can only make leather. Let's make the hide sleeping bag. I bet the canvas might be in the loom then. Let's find out. Give me the sleeping bag because we need to set a respawn point. We've yet to do that. If we were to die, we'd spawn like randomly. Or I think it's a preset des a preset area in the world, but it's really far from where we are now. So I'm going to come up over here like so. Uh, There we go. Face this guy over here. Bam. And then that's all you have to do. Set a uh, new spawn location. Nail the ace to can't be stopped. Now the canvas. Let's see inside of here. Canvas is made from hemp. We have 34 hemp. Okay, that's four. There we go. Let's grab those guys. And then now pop back over into here. And we can make a, a small bed. He's done it. 20 seconds. Oh, my God. Ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be it for today. Thanks so much for watching. Mustache Van Dam here. Make sure if you like the video, don't forget, show your support. Smash the thumbs up button. Feel free to share and favorite the video as you see fit. There's a butterfly coming to visit me. You want to go, butterfly? May the stuff and things be with you. Dead. Dead butterfly. Die. <laughs>